Hey, this is Nolan with Arrow Teardrops. Thank you for joining us today. Uh, this particular trailer, uh, the customer named Remix, and it's actually going to be going home this afternoon. Uh, so anyways, this is an awesome model. This is the Steel, uh, and this particular trailer features our stock anodized sides, uh, silver powder-coated roof, uh, and this particular customer actually opted for a black trim package as well. So that's all blacked out trim, blacked out doors, and then they also opted for a tongue box as well. Like all of our trailers, this features a 3,500 pound Timbrin axle suspension system. And they actually opted for the Raceline uh, blacked out wheels as well. They wanted everything to be nice and contrasty. So, <laughs> so they, they ended up going with that. Uh, some of the other features that this particular trailer has is a Rhino Rack system with custom fabricated mounts that we do. And then also a vehicle awning on the other side, but we'll get more into that a little bit later. Let's take a quick peek at the other side of the trailer and we can kind of go over some of the features over there as well. So over on this side, we've got a five pound propane tank as well as a regular length side table. And as you can see here, we've got our side doors with opening window and bug screen. Kind of what I was talking about a moment ago was the 78 inch vehicle awning. So this particular awning actually is about 78 inches wide and comes out about uh, 98 inches long. It has two legs that pop out as well, as well as some uh, hookups for uh, tent stakes. So it's an awesome option, especially to get out of this blaring heat or, uh, or, or rain, because you know that never happens in the Pacific Northwest, right? <laughs> Uh, so we're going to wrap around here and take a quick look at the galley as well so we can kind of see what they chose. So again, they've got two end tables here. So these are actually detachable. You can kind of see over here. I'll demonstrate real quick. And so all that's left on the trailer is just that little piece of track. They opted for a extended version as well as a regular version as well. So as we kind of get into the galley here, uh, actually one thing I forgot to touch on was uh, these are the mounts for our light leaf panel system. So they have a 100 watt panel. Um, it's not here right now, but uh, they have a 100 watt panel and we also make a 150 watt version as well. So in the galley, they went with our classic cabinetry package. So uh, clear alder faces all around. They also decided to go with a refrigerator, or sorry, a cooler slide out drawer in which you can put a refrigerated cooler in it if you'd like. The CFX, sorry, the Dometic CFX 335 fits in here, as well as a Yeti Tundra 45, I believe. In the center, we also have a water pullout jug drawer. So if you're looking for a nice little source of fresh water, you can have one of those put in as well. Little bolt action style lock to keep it from sliding around during your travels, as well as some storage drawers. Up top here, we've got two cabinets with an adjustable shelf, so you can really cater it based on your kitchen needs. In the center console here, we've got a 10 amp ZAMP branded charge controller. So this is what runs the panel. A 110 hookup if you're hooked into shore power. And also a four-way here with a USB hookup, 12 volt hookup, voltmeter so you can see exactly what's coming off of the battery, as well as an LED light switch for the dome lights. And now we'll wrap into the inside of the trailer and you can kind of see some of the features that they chose. So on the inside, again, they've got our classic cabinetry. Our standard cabinetry is one piece of Baltic birch that's been CNC'd out. Uh, but this particular cabinetry package is all uh, alder hardwood faces. 
So lots and lots of cabinet space up top here. So plenty of space for clothes, other camping accessories. Down below here, you also have some additional cabinetry storage as well. A little bit larger cabinet than up top. Uh, and then uh, we also have a battery shutoff switch on the inside of that cabinet. Uh, great for winterizing your trailer and everything like that. Two cubbies here on either side or shelves, as well as this extra little storage area. If you go with the Bluetooth speaker system that we offer, um, that's what would go in that place. And then also a 12 volt uh, hookup and 110 hookup. We also have LED dome lights in here. Uh, that's what this switch is. And then the outside switch is for the uh, LED porch lights that we offer. And actually, that's a stock option for all of our trailers. This particular trailer also has a Dometic vent fan. It's a three-speed fan. And this is the standard fan that comes with all of our trailers. However, we do offer a few other options as well. Um, definitely, if you're interested, let us know. We can talk you through all the various options that you have. As we look back this way, we've got a cup holder, and that's on both sides. You've got a corner shelf with a USB hookup, so great for any phones or other media devices. And then we also have a low light LED and a little bit brighter LED as well. So if you want to read on the inside here or just add a little more light to a, uh, a wet day out in the Pacific Northwest, that's a great option. And then a stargazer window, which is standard with all of our steel and steel HC trailers. Now it might be a little difficult for you to see over there, but we also have a fire extinguisher on the inside of the cabin as well as a smoke detector. And then underneath, last but not least, we actually have a little storage area. So this customer did not opt for the table option. They just wanted the storage space. However, if you would like a table mounted bracket, um, we can absolutely do that as well. It's a, a pretty cool offering that we have and really opens up a lot of livability to the space. Thanks a lot for joining us today. Again, this is Remix. This trailer is going home with the customer this afternoon. If you have any questions or wanna look at some of the features available, um, you can hop on our website, give us a call at 503-597-8714, or send us an email at sales at Thanks again for watching. Have a great day, guys.